There we go, guys. We are now back live with episode 3 coming up. We just finished episode 2. Let's do a quick recap now, I guess, about what happened in episode 2. A lot of people died in episode 2. It's weird how far we got from where we started in episode 1. Previously on The Walking Dead. Who do you think did this? Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? What's the most important thing in this world? Clem, it's family. People like Matthew aren't coming back. <laughs> <laughs> Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. Ah! Go to hell, you fucker. We're going home. As a family. That they just said weren't in the... Uh, okay. I don't remember like half of that, but whatever. I literally just played it like 10 minutes ago. I'll go with it though, whatever. What am I, oh, yeah. Like, am I supposed to be saying something, or? You about done over there? Calm down, dude. Yeah, one second. Sorry we killed Thanks your friend, but it's usually me. your dick. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're safer if we stick together. It's gonna be dark soon. Yeah, I know. But it's cool you came. I thought they were gonna tell my dad to go with me. Thanks. You're welcome. <sighs> God, I hate Sarah so much. Everything come out all right, girls? Uh, that's Troy, a weird get him question. Tied up. Yeah, I was gonna say, Troy, shut up. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carver out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. <laughs> it ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? Where's your manners? I used to have a walkie-talkie like that. Oh, really? And what happened to it? Because you can't have this one. It caused trouble. People got hurt because of that stupid thing. People died. Well, if you try and take this one, honey, I'll hurt you myself. Get the girls in back with the rest of them. We got a bit of a drive ahead of us. Ian. Whoa. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey, did he hurt you? Hey, hey! Dang. Awkward silence. Oh, his face. Holy shit. I'm assuming that that happened while I was getting Kenny. Such an awkward silence. Alright, we gotta do something. Come on. Anyone got anything of course, sharp? He it. Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? Like what? 
What do you mean, like what? Something sharp. Anything that can help. A, a fucking... I don't know. Anything. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Sit that. down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill yeah. Nye the Science This guy. whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill. Oh, I see. No, she was fucking is. Bill. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. You could have warned us. Yeah, you didn't tell us he was a fucking psychopath. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that hey, happen. fucking shot Walter in the HUD. That was something. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. Oh, no. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's <laughs> bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny, you can't reason with him. I don't know what you're saying, oh, but shit. it sounds Jack like God. bullshit. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Kenny's right. Wait a minute. We have to do something. We can't just sit here. How is it the kid is the only one that sees what's going on here? Clem, the adults are talking. Hey, shut is up. Is that what this is? All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Sarah, shut up. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. That guy's a flake. I could tell the second I set eyes on him. Kenny, please calm down, please. We'll have to wait and see. It's all we can do. She's right. There's no way to know what's happened to him. I told you already. He's gone. Well, can you get do something? We're close. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and, and use it to shoot, shoot the, the next, next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your car. <laughs> hey, shut up, Doc. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing. But any help would be good. Okay. Hey, Clem. Look at me. You trust me, right? Kenny, please, just... Yeah, okay. I trust you. I'll... I'll do what I can. All right. It's okay to be a little scared, but we gotta do this. All right. <laughs> Kenny! Oh, shit. Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Is he okay? I think so. Oh, what hit me? That <laughs> door. Probably for the best. Damn brakes ain't working for shit. All right, up and at him. Hey, it's Tavia. The fuck? How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. Come here. We've so got southern. Some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now, I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. So be patient with them until it does. And take solace in knowing that they're here to help Those us guys to are, uh, wow. a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, and they're all valid. No one needs to forget what they did. But we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive them. Look how much food they have. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. <laughs> As many of you already know, a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we we'll need you for something. Can I wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. Just come the fuck on, bro. I need him. I need my dad. No, you don't, Sarah. Shut up. He looks after me. Grow 
up, Sarah. You're gonna get us in trouble. I don't care. And don't tell me to grow up. You're just a little kid. I'm older than you. And I never got in trouble before. Yeah, it's well. different now. Yeah. I'll be fine. No, you won't. And with the added manpower joining us this evening, I have no doubt that we will continue Make sure y'all stay off the fans. Bill can see if you're messing with it. Nice lawn chairs, holy shit. Is what we'll do. This is luxury. I'll best get some rest. Cause there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold. But at least I'll be comfortable. Hey guys. Richie! <gasps> You're missing an arm, dude. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. I guess I should say Reggie helped us you, but when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. Why didn't he go with you guys when you left? I think maybe he was supposed to, but then he fell, and everybody kept running. Dang. I know he had both his arms then. And now he has one. Well, shit. Got me working outside. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. Dang. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Why? Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. I'll be fine. Let's see what he wants. Bye, Alvin. Hi, Rich. Oh, hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. All right, let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Uh. Hello. Who are you? This freaks you out. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. It would've been awkward if I would've just stuck on my left hand, just like, oh. Hey, where's oh, Carlos? Sorry. Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? And Nick. Eh, they're both dead. Shit. What about Nick? Yep, same thing. He's always taking stupid risks. Can't say I'm surprised. Poor guy. <laughs> Can you guys save it for the morning? Hey, Mike. Some of us gotta be up early. Sorry about that. No problem. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, Dad. He saved my life. Life, so I put up with that shit. Mike, it's missing an ear. Gee, I can only wonder who they based him off of. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. Who's she? Hmm? Who? The girl over there? Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They were <laughs> sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just like the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. <laughs> They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? About five hours ago. Oh, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not <laughs> as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. Bill, Bill, Look, I've Bill. I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. 
Carver killed my friend Walter. Dang. Okay, I, I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his reasons. Nope, no his reason at all. Is he's a crazy piece of shit. Yep. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. Okay, sure. <sighs> Thank you. It means a lot. She don't speak for all of us. No, but if she doesn't want to cause trouble, she doesn't have to. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. <gasps> I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Well, shit. Man, fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I don't yep. trust him either. He acts... strange. Yeah. I guess getting part of your body chopped off can do that to a fella. You gotta take a look around. Okay. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Sure, I'll have a look around. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Okay. Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep, I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking, there's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. I saw its shadow, it moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. That's when it got me. Can't believe you survived. I can't either, honestly. But Mike killed the walker, then took off the arm really quick, like he'd done it before. Took him two or three swings, but still alive. I still think he got higher than he needed to, but what are you going to do? <laughs> I saw a fellow try that a few months ago. Yeah, like I said, it felt like Mike had done it before. He had a tourniquet on me real quick. Hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? Can I just, like, punch Reggie or something? Looks kind of crappy. <laughs> nice. Hmm, looks rickety. Hello? Is that a fish? Those eyes, holy shit. It's better than the ground. Well, out with it. Do you see any way out of here? 
The fences seem pretty strong. Yeah, they do. All right. A whole house full of building supplies? I guess it ought to be. <laughs> Welcome back, Carlos. Dad! God, shut up, Sarah. All right, go the fuck to sleep. I'm shooting the first one of y'all I see wandering around before sunup. Man, Troy, Troy is such a nice guy. Everybody get to bed. Troy is so nice. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? It's your decision. I'm ready. Of course I am. Good, good. Confidence is good. You gotta have the right attitude. Now get some sleep. We'll need okay. It. Wow, you're really nice, Troy. Those eyes. Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. Mr. Bill is speaking. We all must listen to Mr. Bill's words of the wiser. Hello, Bill. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning, but that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now... Yep. How things went. Well, that's all in the past now. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here. Forgiveness. By proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Reggie, you're nearly back in. Keep following the path and we'll welcome you Follow back. Follow the path to the enlightenment. How'd you sleep? Let Shut up, Sarah. I'm so tired. Salvation is available, but it I didn't even must realize be earned. That. Shut up, Sarah. Kenneth will be taking over Reggie's duties outside the walls, and Michael will continue on I showing his value. Nice finally... Carlos! Thank you. Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. Oh, I know what that means. I'm sorry. I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. I'm sorry, sir. No, no. That ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. Hit her. You discipline her now, Carlos. Hit her! How do you propose that one I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Yes, finally. Come on, we'll wait. My... Do it, Carlos! Sure with my hand that I... Well, that's why you got two hands, Carlos. I was gonna say, it's two for a reason. Just do it. Not some mamby pamby thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. Oh you boy. That. He can be overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then you <laughs> Go on, Carlos. She's Just gonna stay get quiet. Over with. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Hit her! Come on, hit her! I want to see this. Do it. Oh, God! You got knocked the fuck out! I'm sorry, sir. Stop! That's a KO. You're not coddling that girl anymore. Better sit there and think about what she's done. That was a KO. So I get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to Dude, work. Dude, he slapped the shit out of her. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. The correction is real. You're working in the armory. Follow me. Oh, hi, Tavia. 
You were so nice like a month ago. <laughs> yeah, that's a huffy slap. Probably had a ring on too. Clementine. Who's this? She's one of the new people. Hey, it's she Becca. Carlos and Sarah. And Shell. Sarah? I wish she'd stay gone. She's <laughs> <a good laughs> Becca. Even Becca so hates weird. her. We're not sitting on the ground like babies. And that's why I like Becca. Bonnie's waiting. She's a realist. Oh, why, hello, Bonnie. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. Piece of shit. We're loading magazines. Sports Illustrated in there? Oh, I guess not. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. I wasn't truthful. Gee, you don't say. At the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. You're also the but person that hit someone over the now, or over the head with a pipe dead. to kill him. And I can't help but feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. It was just a bad situation that got worse. A lot of people are to blame. That's big of you, but I know what I've done. But I wanted you to know I regret my part in all this. She's a real southern bale. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. How was your first night in the yard? I know it ain't so comfortable, but it's safe. You mean my first night in prison? It ain't a prison. More of a work release. Don't Didn't they have those in, those in prisons? Oh, yeah. I... Probably. I don't know. I've never been to prison. Well, you were the drug addict, don't so I, mean, I won't be surprised. Trying to keep a tough reputation. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. They never mentioned you. No? Hmm. Not even Luke? I can only imagine what her and Luke well, did. I mean, that's to be expected, ain't it? You don't know me, do you? What are they gonna say? Bonnie ain't here? You wouldn't know what he was talking about. I guess that could be it. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. That's not Take true at all. situation with the herd. That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to be somewhere comfortable for a while. What changed? I don't know. I've been trying to figure that out myself. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not defending I, what he did. That I was, was gonna say he did killed Walter. I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. He killed Walter. Only to protect his own people. Kenny could have killed us all. But he yeah. didn't. Bill overreacted. He was in the heat of the moment and he overreacted. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads. Then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. That was quick. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Huh? What do you think? <laughs> Holy shit. I found it at the lodge y'all were at. That's a sweet think jacket. It might be for skiing. It's cool. I like it. Well, I'm glad. God. I thought it was cute, but I didn't know what you'd think. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. Thanks, Tavia. What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. Can that be Corey Platinum's new jacket? Follow me. Come He's on. He's just gonna wear that to the ring.
Stay in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. Hey. You have to be tough, Sarah. Everything is harder now, but you have to be tough to survive. Sarah, you're so useless. My dad's never hit me before. Get over it. Even when I was really bad. <laughs> he never hit me. Yeah. You can kind of control it sometimes. How much it hurts. It takes practice. Really? I don't want to practice that. Too bad. I don't think anyone does. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. <laughs> Well, Sarah, you see. Oh, Reggie's here. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep, no problem, Tavia. Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Pick up a pair of those shears. Okay. Okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just well, I don't know. You tell me. Basket. Simple. Are we picking them, Reggie? While you're at it, if you see any dead thing. Got it? Sure. Doesn't seem too hard. Sarah, do something, you useless piece of shit. Hey, so... Is she gonna be okay? No, not at all. Because what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. She's a baby. There's no helping her. Whoa, that's harsh, kid. I think if Bill did that to me, I'd cry a little too. Look, God, Reggie, you suck as much as Sarah. I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. That was awkward. That was awkward? Yep, it was. I won't do that again. I'm gonna go work now. Okay, bye. God, I hate some of these people in this so much. Holy shit, Sarah, do something. They're so useless. Are those live branches? Oh shit. Oh no. What? What did you do? These are only half done. Are those live branches? Yeah, they are. Clementine, I asked you to help her. Just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. Hmm. Reggie. Yeah, Bell. Hey. What hey. the fuck happened in here? Look, Bill, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy- I just have- I have- I have one arm. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> shut up, shut up, You shut better have fuck an explanation up. for this. God, and that was amazing. Now, Bill, please, just- Sounds just, like you were about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. Sarah, she didn't understand. No, this ain't your fault. Oh, we wait a minute. About this, Reggie, didn't we? But you just don't get it, do you? Get what? I, I... Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about. Oh, boy. They're gonna talk. <laughs> Clementine's like, I'm not sorry, Reggie. The help girls. What's wrong, Sarah? Are you okay? Oh, hi, Reggie. No, 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 no. Push him off! No! 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 Please! Ah! 
Oh god! Good oh, god, he's broken in half! Incompetence. Fuck god, Michael! It puts us all at risk, and it won't be tolerated. You think about that. The next time he's just been throwing up Tantron. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Go! Okay. Good trophy, long way down. Oh, hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. Okay. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. <laughs> My sweet jacket. What's wrong? Clem? You alright? Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe. Maybe Joe, did you see any of that? Accident. Joe, you're missing all the Listen, good shit. You missed Sarah getting slapped. You missed Reggie guys, getting pushed off of a roof. Just be safe, okay? Now ain't the time to be calling attention to yourself. I need to go find out what happened. Hey, Troy, Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. All right. Go on. <laughs> oh, there he is. Hey, He's dead. That ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Holla, holla, holla. We them boys. <laughs> Shoe sale. It's a lot of walkers. Half off shoes. I ain't nobody's laborer. Fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Hey, Kenny, here you go. Fucking hands off you me, ain't man. gonna force me to hey, do it's this Mike Tyson. Bullshit. I said, get your hands off me. It's Mr. Parvenir. He's named Mike. He's black. Me. I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, this is a real help. Why don't you just worry about yourself? Get off me! Reggie's dead. Carver killed him. What? You sure? Who did you? Oh shit! Oh, shit! Fuck! Grab something! Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Dunk. <laughs> Boink. Okay. Uh, shit. Come on, get through. Ooh, great kill. Never mind, there's more. God, this sledgehammer. Oh! The knee. Quick, hit the zombie in the head. Can't see shit. Can't see shit. Hello there. Thank you, sir. Get out of there. Come on. Make me save your ass. Jesus. Oh, thank God, you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? Asshole. How'd they even get through? Ah, 
comic books. Science dog. Hello there. No, stop! Hey, hey, it's me, Luke. Okay, just calm down. Come all this way. This is this is the welcome I get. Sorry. I was we all were. Yeah, it's good to see you too, kid. All right. The reason why I didn't hit X is because that would have bit him. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. Well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming, and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get you all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah. Yes. Sorry. I, I just could use some sleep, you know? Hard to rest when you think Luke's, like, losing it over here. Holy any, shit. Any moment, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Okay, don't worry about me. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but, well, we're in it now. That's what we got. We just, we just need a plan. No way to get you. I like that poster or, or that stand-up over there. Because you see it's like the arrows, like his Luke. penis. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry, shit. Okay, Troy ain't gonna like you being late. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just, just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. We just gotta be smart, okay? We, we gotta plan. Okay, I I'll get you one. Thanks, Clem. I'm so glad I can count on you. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see you. Clementine, Clementine come out get with the hands up. I was looking at com comics. There's a whole store full of them. Yeah? No shit. You best not dawdle, girly. Pull something like that again and you'll be meeting the back of my hand. Oh, okay. Bill Radio. Wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there now. Hey, it's Wyatt. Hello, Wyatt. Dude, you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. <laughs> Okay, Wyatt. So you should probably go. Rebecca. She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Hmm. Get in here. Alvin? Alvin! Hmm. He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. <laughs> I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Now. You make sure you tell exactly, the truth Sean. when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. <laughs> he was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks Yeah, exactly, like Sean. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. 
And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. I understand. I knew you were a smart girl. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I know. I have to do everything for them. It's exhausting. Of course it is. But that's the role you're meant to play. And we're more alike than you think. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized that back in that cabin, you were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this hurt that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing. If I got anyone to hand all this off to. But I ain't worried about that anymore. I'll help you. Whatever you need. I know I'm just a kid, but I'll do my best. Well, that's all I can ask. All right, now. Bill? You there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Try really not the shit out of it. <laughs> How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. No. Stan. Thought our Michaels kicked him. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Cause this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous! Sound draws walkers. There was this girl, Molly. She used bells to control where they moved. Yeah, that's right. She had them running all over Crawford. We just need something loud. Mm -hmm. Well, unless you've got a megaphone tucked in your pocket, it doesn't help us much now. <laughs> I still vote we get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Oh, come on. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? Look, Clem had it right. We just need something loud to get their attention. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Ty. Is always using is quite loud. You see, Carver, I just can't stand. Pointed toward the parking lot. I saw him when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. Why can't we do both? Even if we bring the herd to us, it's probably good for Luke to be able to tell us where they're coming from. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay, so we get that turd radio. <laughs> While Kenny. On the herd's Kenny's just like, okay, I don't like him, but we'll do it. To roll over this place. And then what? 
Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. <laughs> I figured out what your problem is. You don't plan to improvise. Well, if the end of the you never know. If the end of the is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do. Oh, hello all the there. Time. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me, I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Lee figured that out. What? <laughs> it's how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. I remember that. <sighs> Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. <laughs> All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. <laughs> Is she really low tie? Where did she come from? We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then, just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so... You probably won't fall to your death. Great. Probably won't fall. All the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Which is why I'm going. Come on, up and at him. Don't she weighs like 90 pounds. Way. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Come on, Mike Tyson, let's go. Don't let go. I got you. Let's ride. Try to hurry, all right? So slow. I think they're the sharpest guards in the world. Is that barbed wire? No idiots either. They see you not in your bunk. We're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something. Okay. Oh, that's a shoulder right there. That's a lot of walkers. We're in trouble. That's a lot of walkers. We are fucked. Hello there, sir. <laughs> yeah. In the parking lot? No, not in the parking lot. Can't see them all, but I can see the dust they're kicking up. So you're not sure? Yeah. What about how many there are? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hello, Tavia. She's doing a really shitty guard at watch. It's crazy about Reggie, huh? Yeah. Kind of fucked up. Think Bill. Yep. Nah, it's just I was wondering if you thought Bill maybe. Spit it out, Hank. Come on, Hank. I don't think Bill was gonna let him back in. Huh? You don't? No. Do you? I don't know. I don't know what I've been told. So really, no bullshit. You think we're ready? Yeah, I'm sorry, Joe. Think so? Yeah. I'm not sure about the expansion. Yeah. They're out there just moaning. That's what they do. Yeah. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. Yeah. I know what you mean. I figure we'd be used to it by now. Yeah. What to figure that? Never got used to a light buzzing or anything. Well, no. Dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. So what are you doing tomorrow? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that while you're down there? Yep. 
Yep. <laughs> See, now she's stealing your gimmick. Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people in. See, it's hard not to call the prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. Oh, we got the radio. Really? We oh, we're we're taking two. To get this place built. I can't say for sure if we even had them. You can't be smoking back here. Vince, come on. Don't hey, yo, that. Vince. If Bill smells a whiff of smoke back here, he'll flip. What are you thinking? You know what? Hi, I'm Vince. Welcome to your one line in this whole series. That's bullshit. Vince. Vince, come on. Vince. Hey, Vince. She is not a my fifth five. <laughs> Oh, lay. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. Don't drop me, Mike. There we go. We best get in bed. Troy, be Vince, be in my face, five. Well? You little devil. <laughs> I love how she's like, well, at least it's better than the ground, then she sleeps on the ground. Everybody stay where you are. I like how they all sleep with their hats on, too. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Thanks. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Anyway, get some rest. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Like how he got Sean killed. Kid was always running. How he got that circus. other person killed. Every damn place he went. How he just, just ran around, run. did absolutely he jack shit the entire time. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. Well, long day tomorrow. One long day. One long day. One more match. Batista. All right, we're all here. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we... Okay, better stop talking now. Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going. To, to work. work. Rebecca, Sarah, Jane, if you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. What about the rest of us? Up for the rest of oh, wait, never mind. I said, never mind. I just remembered not. Yeah, I just remember then. something. Like I said, Ty. Troy's coming for the rest of you. Shawnee's freaking innovator. Welcome to you. Welcome to YouTube. Alright, look, if we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him, I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> no offense, but come on, that's crazy. She's a kid. Why would- There's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? Who's Adam? I'm trusting someone to do something this important. I'm trusting her. Kenny's right. I should do it. Don't do something stupid just to get some respect. She doesn't need your respect. Give me the radio. Dang. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pack. All right. I don't all think right, little chickens, get to like pack. so southern. No, way. no shenanigans. This rooster's going to be surveilling your ass this every rooster. second of the <laughs> day. What's with the freaking farm jokes? Holy shit, dude. Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. We got it, all right? Silence. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. Let me do this totally not discreetly at all. Could have very easily it just handed it to me, you moron. On something. I'll 
Let's go. Yeah, we're gonna give the big boy a mic a push. Possibly off a roof. I don't know. He'll be like Reggie. He got a push. Hey, she's with me. Oh shit! I almost forgot. Yeah. 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 Well, take her then. I don't care. Yeah. Wait, wait. What's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. Can't you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. It's nothing that'll hurt her. Come on. Silence. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. I didn't believe you when you told me about Reggie. I ran and found Bill once I left you. Figured even if he had done it, he'd make up some sort of excuse, but... Bill was just so matter-of-fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something. Like yeah. Like it had to be done, and that was just one of those moments when your blood runs cold. Yeah. Goose pimples up and down your arm. Goose pebbles? Wait, what? Out the person you thought you knew Joe, is that a southern term? Never there. Goose pebbles? You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? You know you can talk to me, right? I was dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on everything holy that'll never happen again. Bonnie, I swear on everything holy. Give this to him. He needs it. Clementine, and all I need from you is to just not care where I am for 15 minutes. If you get caught and you mention my name, Carver will be the least of your troubles, okay? Well, what are you waiting for? God, that accent. Clementine's from freaking Georgia and she has absolutely no accent whatsoever. Same with like Lee and Kenny. Kenny's from freaking Florida. Oh, hey, Russell. Who gave you Russell an AK-47? Like Y'all be going now, you hear? Bill don't like idle hands. Russell, you're just sitting there doing nothing. Y'all better hurry that shit up. I hate babysitting you assholes. Alex, it was goose, not ghost. Luke? I don't fucking know. Doesn't really matter. Sorry, what a clause. Hey! You ain't supposed to be out here. Aw. You people been here one fucking day and already you're fucking up. Well, you wait and see what happens. Move! Hey! I'm just saying, she seems like the kind of perfect person. She doesn't even have a black accent and she's... She's freaking black. Like, she has like... She has you the whitest know. voice actor ever for her. And There's nothing wrong with it, but I'm just saying. Our trust. With treachery, with oh, deceit, hey, Luke. With theft. What's going on? I don't know, Clem. Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. God damn it, Luke, you, you suck! You can't just run from your problems. You can't just up and leave when it gets tough. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Tough is all we got now. Get that through your fucking skulls. Alex, we already we already had the juice boxes. That was episode one. Luke here, he can't help That's you. over. We're done with that. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. You gotta help me you find stop. the strength to forgive you. where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio ain't Everybody, again, three, count. We'll one, two, difficult. three. Sorry, Sean, it's a ghetto accent. One. Two. Three. I got, I got it right here. It's all right. Sorry.
sorry about that. Not sure what I was thinking. Three. <laughs> Fucker. Oh! No! God. Oh! Stop oh! Somebody stop him! Let me stop. go! Clementine, help me! Oh, God. Oh! Oh! Oh God! Clementine down! Oh God! Bill! That's enough, Bill! Please! Good God! Bill, there's a breach! All right, everyone come with me. Bonnie, you stick around. Make sure these folks don't get into any more trouble. Yeah, okay. No supper for y'all tonight. Maybe an empty stomach will give you some perspective. Clementine and Kenny are both down. Holy tomorrow. shit. Good God. He dead as hell. Able to move, cause we're leaving tonight. We're leaving tonight. Clementine got like a freaking rifle like to her face. Good God. <laughs> that is the punch, it's 2k. That's the sound effect. Holy shit. What are Luke and Mike doing? They're just staring. Oh, I think they're talking to Bonnie, I see. What'd she say? She said she can get us out of the pen if we get the PA system going. Second she hears it, she'll run over and spring us. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. I was hungry, I got reckless trying to steal some food, and I got caught. We can't stay here. Exactly. We have no idea how long Alvin's got before Bill just kills him. We have to leave now. <laughs> Carver is in my Look, pay five. Saying, but it's risky. Risky? Did you see what that son of a bitch just did? The, the plan works. Nothing needs to change. It's all set up. The hard part is done. This guy's fucking crazy. Who knows what he'll do next? Yeah, but now we're dealing with a guy beat to shit. Sarita in no shape to do anything, and I'm a goddamn mess. Look, I'm a hot mess. We should rest up. Okay, we should bide our time. And we should wait for an opening. Bonnie's agreed to help us tonight. And that doesn't mean she can't do it some other night. We're not waiting. Ain't nothing out there, guys. Trust me, I've looked. There's no food. There's no supplies. They picked everything clean. I'm just saying we gotta be sensible about this. Where's Kenny? Doc's over there working on it. And don't look good. Hi there. Everyone is so beat up. This is what I'm talking about. Is he gonna be okay? His orbital is crushed. I don't think there's much hope for the eye. I got well. him as stable as I could, cleaned it. Until he wakes up, we won't know if there's any damage to the brain. <laughs> Fuck. Dang. Okay, look. Maybe I'm just playing devil's advocate here, but if... Damn it, if y'all are serious about going tonight, then we're gonna have to start talking about maybe leaving some folks behind. No. No! There is no other way. This is bullshit. Well, I don't like it either, but guess what? It's where we're at. I deal with the elbows. And now you intend to leave us behind. So we should risk all of our lives? What are you saying? No, we're not leaving Kenny. Kenny! That's not fair. We stay together. It's not fair. We're just trying to make the best of a bad situation here. No one wants to leave Kenny. And you won't have to. Because you won't have to. I'm all right, hon. We leave tonight. Plan don't change. You are one tough bastard. Do tough bastards get their ass kicked in front of everybody? You all right? That wasn't your fault, okay? Aww. It's all right. 
two people who got that shit beat out of them are hugging it out. All right. Well, then what now? We get the hell out of here. Like now, now. Yes. Where are we going? In case things get squirrely and we gotta make a break for it, we squirrely. need a place to meet up. We could meet out at Parker's Run. The hell is that? It's a Civil War site a few miles north. Tourist trap. Got signs all over. Just follow the road. We stopped there after we escaped. Follow the, the road time. to the fruity taste that shows. It's not that. Oh, I know. It's followed in your uh, nose. At Shit. Least if a few Botched folks it. Know where it's at. It'll be easy to find if we're split up. All right, that works. Then we just need someone to go set off that PA, right? I mean, you never bothered to explain who's supposed to do that. Hi. I wasn't serious. Don't look at me. I just got the ship beat out of me. And I'm 11. Wait, Anyone wait, else see that wait, lemon sign in the background? The Let's go. Be sure to remember to flip the switch for the outdoor speakers. Just the indoor speakers might not draw the herd. It's right on the microphone box. Right. By default, it's set to play music. So you should just have to turn it on, right? Then climb back up and drop into the stock room. We'll meet you there. Okay. Yep, I got it. Bye. I'm ascending into heaven. Okay. Goodbye. Clint, make sure you bring Alvin. I'll try. Can't guarantee anything. He's kind of beat the hell last time we saw him. Joe, did you see Alvin last time? Yeah, Alvin's not looking too good. Alvin? I like how you put on plastic so his floor doesn't get stained. Okay? Wake up. Yeah, he's dead as hell. Well, that was pointless. Jesus. Four X's on that bottle. Oh god. It's potent shit. Okay, Hello. Now the mic. Who's Mike? Oh. What? What's wrong? Is there uh is there anything in there or No, 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 no. 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 There we go. Come on, come on. Please work. This Fourth of July, make sure your backyard barbecue is complete with Howe's full line of products to meet your grilling needs. It's funny because those tapes there are labeled as the same exact thing that the uh, ones from Crawford were. Which is interesting. Alvin, are are you okay? Oh, okay. Carver talks all that tough guy shit, then keeps the tiniest gun in the universe. There's <laughs> something funny about that. You have the project, we have the know-how. How? Napa know-how, Napa know-how. Come on. We have to go. I ain't going anywhere. But you are. Gone. I mean to get some payback. No, we're leaving. We're all leaving. Dang. I ain't fit to move, kid. I've, I've run out of road. Aw. But no, I'll, I'll just go up there and shut that thing off. Oh, okay. You gotta get out of here. They'll be here any second. Thank you. You take care of my girls. I get the feeling it's, it's going to be a girl. Just a hunch. Go on. <laughs> oh no, Alvin. Oh, payback's a bitch. Well, he's dead. That 
That's a lot of walkers. Holy shit. Hey, Tavia. I was gonna say, watch your fingers there. Oh, well, that didn't work. Yeah, we tried. Fucking fine. Wanna run off with this dog shit group of crippled fucks? Then fine. Be my guest. But I will put a bullet in you and that baby. Dang. Haha! -ha! Drop kick. Oh, right hook. The Huffman hook. Get back. Well, shit. Come on, Luke. This ain't none of your business. Clem, where? Why isn't Alvin with you? Where is he? Ah, uh, he got shot. <laughs> that face. Rebecca, I am. Oh God, I am so sorry. Kill him. Dang. Rebecca, Rebecca, sweetie, my God, how did we get here, you and me? This is just a bit of a custody battle we got on our hands here. Shoot him. Silence. <gasps> oh, Kenny, with the knee shot. Oh, the other knee. This is how Moore is taking out future next match. I can see it already. Just gonna shoot him right in his knees. Good God, where'd he get the crowbar from? It's Kevin Come Ryan. It wait outside. Y'all don't want to see this. We have to go. Kenny, please. I only need a minute. Go Good on. Good God. You don't need to see this. That girl's already seen more than you can imagine. Shut your mouth, Bill. You're all just going to let him do this? Yes. There ain't one part of that son of a bitch I don't hate, but that does not make this right. I'm not, I'm not going anywhere. anywhere. It's gonna get messy. I don't care. I know. <laughs> I Look know. You, you fucking ingrates. I don't even know how good you got it. That's all right. You'll learn. Lambs to the slaughter. No shepherd to guide you. Clementine knows exactly what I'm talking about. Come on. Come on, Clem. Fucking big man, huh? No, I'm not letting you see this. It's not your decision. Dang. Atta girl. She ain't afraid to look it in the eye. You go with that feeling you got right now, Clementine. That's what makes you stronger than Come the rest on. of them. Let's go. Yeah, go on. Let the sheep out of the pen. We'll see how long that lasts. I'll be right there. You won't see anything. Dang. That's Coming from you. <laughs> How's that eye? You guys want to... Just follow my voice. It'll get you there. You got a thick fucking skull, Kenneth. <laughs> Should've put you out of your misery right then. Now look at you. You're a mess. Dang. The fuck are you looking at, bitch? Don't act like you didn't love every second. Oh, okay, he's dead. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, still hitting him. Oh, still going. Oh, he's not done. Still going. Still going. Still going. One more. Yep, he's dead. He's dead. <laughs> Wonder if he destroyed the brain or not. Let's go. Yep, that just happened. Kane's got a crowbar to defend himself. Okay. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm alright. Come on. 
We got enough to worry about. Shit. I thought they were coming from the south. They did. Looks like we're in the eye of it now. Fuck. This is fucked. Here. You're gonna need something. Thanks. Luke somehow still has that machete. Hello. Let's go. You guys better hurry up and get to smearing if you want to live. Or you can die here. It doesn't matter to me. Do it quick. We need to get covered before the rest of them get close or we're fucked. Ooh. I'll go first. Guts. You're gonna put that on yourself? Yep, it's the only way to survive, Sarah. Did you not listen to anything? I feel like I've done this before. Okay, now you turn around. Smells gross. Doesn't matter. Shit. Everybody shut the fuck It'll up. Be okay, honey. Just stay still. Uh, are you sure? I'm sure. There's nothing to fear if you remain calm. I'll keep you safe. Hurry the fuck up. Turn around. I'll get your back. We ain't got all day here. Everybody ready? They're almost what on us. What in the actual fuck is going on here? Troy, shut up. This sick shit. Someone say something before I start. Hey, hey, hey! Don't you even fucking think about it, motherfucker. I will end you. You hear I me? I will end you. <laughs> Troy. So angry. Troy, we talked about this. What? The fuck you talking about? I told you I wanted to get out. You said you'd help, then I'd help. I thought you meant get out of the pen, not whatever the fuck this shit is. <laughs> I did. But now we can leave. Troy, you can come with us. <laughs> what? Well, where would we go? Away from here. Together. Man, you smell really bad. You gotta get a bath before we- <laughs> Oh, my God. Don't make any- God. <laughs> and for fuck's sake, walk Good God, just shot his dick off. Holy shit, that, that just hurt me watching that. <laughs> you're not you really need a lot more than ammo, buddy. Good God, just shot his dick off. Tavia, Vince, other blonde chick. Quiet. They were all up there. It'll be okay. Don't run. Watch Sarah. Quiet, honey. Clementine, come help me. Calm Sarah, down. shut up. Please, just say something. You're a friend. Oh, God. Okay, well, Carlos is dead. Good God, freaking Sarah, shut up! Can we just kill her? Yep. Oh, bitch slap. Bye, okay. Oh, I'll get it out, get it out, get it out. Oh! That was perfect. Oh, uh... 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 What do I do? Shit. Hand, head, uh, uh, head. <laughs> Fuck it. You got bit, bitch. Oh, that's the end of the episode. Shit.
Sarah's glasses. She's gonna get someone killed. Yep. You didn't have to take the radio. Carver wouldn't have hurt me like this. Of course I had to. No telling what that ass white would have done to you. So how's it look? Am I still gonna be pretty when this heals? <laughs> nope, not at all. You need to get past that walker without drawing all the others. What are you gonna do? Not now. Not now, damn it. Since when is that the sound that an AK-47 makes in this game? They're all gonna die, Clementine. <laughs> it Don't sounded like a freaking pistol. Okay, let's see. You and 23.3% of players did all of the work by ourselves when helping Sarah. Why would we help Sarah? Why do people like Sarah? She's useless. Uh, you and 51.3% of players told Bonnie and Luke that Luke contracted to you or contacted you. I can't talk. Uh, I, me and 42.4% of players tried to speak up about stealing the walkie-talkie. Me and 68.3% of players watched Kenny beat the shit out of Carver. And wow, only 17.3% of players killed the zombie that bit Sarita. Everyone else chopped off Sarita's hand, but by doing that, that then... A makes Kenny a whole lot more pissed at you, and B it makes Sarita freak out because well you just chopped her hand off, and then after that she gets bit by a lot more walkers, and she then just dies right there. Other